Hey, 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 there's a new licensed driver. It's official, right? Afraid not. What are you talking about? I'm not, it's not official. I'm not licensed. I didn't pass the stupid test. Are you kidding me? Does it look like I'm kidding? I didn't pass, okay? Don't make such a big deal about it. Um, okay, I mean, how did it go? I mean, what'd you do wrong? Guy was a big jerk, you know. He had in for me before I even started the car. I think that guy gets off flunking people. So because the guy was a jerk, he got flunked? Well, because the guy was such a jerk, he kind of made me nervous, and I like drove straight through a stop sign. And that's like supposed to be like an automatic failure or something. <laughs> Big deal. At least I didn't run into anything. Well, I'm sorry, Bright. I know you're looking forward to getting your license. Just take it again, just with a different driving instructor, and make sure to stop when you're supposed to. Pass the first time. I got lucky. I had a woman instructor. She had the hots for me. Shut up. You think all women have hots for you? It's, I have all the looks in the family. You know it's true. Speaking of women. Yeah, you need some lessons in that department? What I need is a license to drive. To pick up Becky for a date. Becky? You have a date? Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Look who's moving up in the world. Who's Becky? She's this girl that agreed to go out with me because she thought I could drive. Oh. You got a problem. <laughs> Help? What do you want me to do? And drive you on your date? That's not cool, bro. I really want this girl to like me. And I don't want to blow. What are we supposed to do? Take the bus? I thought I had my license before Friday night, and Mom agreed to give me the car if I passed. And we both laughed because we just thought I would pass. Like I had the DMV as of my life. Suck it up, bro. Just call her and tell her what happened. She'll totally understand. <clears throat> Maybe. But she'll also cancel. She made this big deal about hate sh how she hates being driven around and can't wait to get her license. And she hates guys who can't drive. Bro, okay. If, if, if Becky won't go with a guy... Oh, wait, no. Sounds like a real cat. Kind of high maintenance, right? You said it, bro. If Becky doesn't want to go out with you because you funked your driving test, is she really the right person for you? I didn't hear your looks, remember? So when a girl finally asks to go out, says, he, says yes to going out with me, I think I should take the chance. What do you want me to do? Give me your car. You're insane! Come on! I know how to drive. I'm a good driver. It's perfectly safe to get in the car with me. All I need is a car, just go pick up Becky, go to the movies, and come on. See, it's not even a lot of driving on all surface streets. You'll never get away with it. I will, if you help me. Mom and Dad will never find out if you don't tell them. And how are you, and... <laughs> Fine, thank you. And if you don't get pulled over. And if you don't get pulled over. I'll only get pulled over if, you, if I do something wrong. And I won't do anything wrong. I'll be the most perfect driver. Maintain speed limit, speed limit, buckle my seatbelt, have my hands at 10 o'clock and 2 o'clock. See, I know how to drive. Please, just help me out. Do this for me once, bro. That's what brothers are for. Here comes the guilt trip. Okay. But well, what if one day you're driving and you get into an accident? We'll both be screwed. What is going to happen? Yeah, like you said, you drive. When you're driving perfectly, someone here ends you. Then you have to exchange info, insurance, driver's license. What are you going to do about that? So, give me your license. I mean, it's not gonna happen. When anything does happen, I'll just say, I'll just give me your info and I'll just say you were driving. You have a criminal mind. I never knew this about you. Come on, I just want this girl to like me. Just this once. Mm. This is big time. I'll, I'll be incredibly careful. Nothing is gonna happen. And if anything does happen, I'll take full responsibility for it. How are you supposed to carry this out without mom and dad finding out? Okay, so you park the car down the block. I say I'm going to go study at Evie's, and you say you're going out. They never ask for you going out anywhere anyway. It's all covered. I'm back by 11, park the car down the street, and I'm home. I'm home. You, you scare me. Cut it out. So this is the deal. It must be crazy, but if anything happens, anything will you so hard. Relax, nothing's gonna happen. And next week, I'll just take the test again, and I'll get my license for real. I hope so. Have faith, bro. Oh, I will. I'll be praying all night long. See you.